Rifle High School Armband Program. This here is one of our shoulder exercises that help work on our rotator cuff. As you'll see here, he raises it directly in front of him, about shoulder height. It's just performed like that. This next exercise works on the uh, rear rotator cuff muscles, kind of a lateral pull, uh, as you'll see demonstrated by a couple of our athletes here. We do about four sets of ten if it's the heavy resistance. If it's the lighter resistance, we can do four sets of fifteen, depending on which uh, of the bands that they have. In this band exercise, our players have the band underneath their feet. They will extend their arms out to the side as high as their shoulders, going up and down under a controlled motion. This exercise we call reverse shakes. As he's extended his arms out to the side, he's going to shake them as quickly back and forth as he can in just little short shakes. Good, Tristan. That's what it should look like if you're shaking it quick. These are called front shakes demonstrated here correctly. In this exercise we have an internal rotation. Uh, the key here is to keep the elbow steady and keep the um, extended hand at about a 90 degree angle to the upper arm going, pulling it forward just like this. We will also do external rotations and it's demonstrated right here, again, keeping the elbow tight to the body, not letting it move a lot. It's going out. We'll do four sets of ten of the internal rotation, four sets of ten of the external rotation, until we've had both arms done. Here's another series of our rotator cuff armband exercises. This one done here, the elbow is held as high as the shoulder with an external rotation upwards with the hand. And then the opposite of that will be the internal rotation over the top, similar to a throwing motion that looks similar to this right here. Make sure that the elbow is as high as the shoulder and keep it rotating just as you see here.